Hi guys. Magic here. Welcome to my channel if you're new and if not, welcome back. Come on in. Let's hang out some today because I have what I think is a fun video. I'm going to be sharing my Disney puzzle collection. I am a huge puzzler. Usually not every night, but a lot of nights. That's kind of how I unwind. You know, I'll sit down and work on a puzzle even if it's just for like 10 minutes or so. Some puzzles, it takes me a while to do a lot of them, but that's okay. To me, it's fun, and I just like to see the ending, you know, see see how it comes together. And I don't save my puzzles or, you know, glue them or anything. There's a couple of Harry Potter ones that I'm going to do that with. But for the most part, I just haven't found any that, you know, make me want to do that. But who knows? I never say never when I put it, you know, when I'm working on one, I if I like it, I might glue it, but... I haven't yet. So I don't think I'm going to start off. Uh, there's not really going to be a favorite order. Um, let's go by, you know what, let's go by size order. So I've got a couple of 550 pieces here. I got Dumbo. Now, I know Dumbo's not one of my favorite movies, but I mean, it was a Disney puzzle. And honestly, the majority of these, let's see. Uh, actually... I got about four or five of these for Christmas, and the rest I've honestly found at Goodwill. And this is one of the ones I found at Goodwill. See, okay, tell me if yours is like this, though. I'll go in sometimes, and the puzzles are $1.19. So, I mean, I have no idea. I haven't put this one together yet, so I have no idea if all the pieces are going to be there. But even if not at $1.19, I'll take the risk. But sometimes I'll go in, and they're $1.99. Which is, either way, I mean, that's still not bad. It's just funny to me that they, they fluctuate like that. But this one, I remember, actually, there's a story with this one. This is the, one of the first puzzles I ever decided to buy for myself. I, one day, just decided I wanted to do a puzzle, so I went over to the toy section at work right after our new store opened and happened to see this one. So I'm so excited. I get home. I put it together, and it's missing at least one piece, if not two. I can't remember because it's been, this has been about six years ago. So, this, that, I, I, was, I wasn't happy that it was missing a piece. But that also turned into kind of this thing where every brand new puzzle I bought myself has been missing at least two pieces. So that's why I decided I just buy them at Goodwill now. I haven't bought myself a brand new puzzle in a long time. I have more luck with, with Goodwill anyway. So, I save a little bit of money and hopefully have better luck. This one I've actually done. This was 750 pieces. Pocahontas. I got this one for Christmas from Mom and Dad. Love it. It was a tough one to put together. Because there's an actual kind of better view of the whole picture. A lot of the colors are very similar. And so, it was so tough to get together. This one I have not done yet, and I am super excited about. I'm going to save this one. I'm going to do this one like the last puzzle before we leave to go to Disney. But it is my girl Rapunzel and Flynn Rider. So I'm trying to, there we go. I'm trying not to get the glare from the light. Most, of, The majority of what I have are going to be the Thomas Kincaid's. But I'm super excited about this one. I can't wait to get that one together. This one, actually I did buy myself this one not too long ago. I decided to give it a shot. I had an Amazon gift card. That's why. I bought this one off of Amazon. Mulan. Got Mushu. Is Cricky on there? I can't tell. Probably somewhere. But yeah, I I thought this was pretty. I love Mulan. So I'm excited to try this. I have a feeling this one is going to be extremely hard. Just like the Pocahontas. So, we'll see. This was actually another Goodwill find. I was like, super excited about this one. It's the Disney pin puzzle. Y'all seen my channel. If you haven't, I'm a huge pin collector. So, 
this one when I saw it, I was like, I have to have that one. I put this one together. I think it was missing like two pieces, which I hate it when they're missing pieces. But like I said, at $1.99, it's better than paying full price for one that's missing a piece, in my opinion. So I decided to give it a shot. This one, I don't remember where I got. I might have gotten it for Christmas a couple years ago from mom and dad. But the Yoda, one of my favorite Star Wars characters. They have more in this set too. I want to try to get a couple more of them. I can't remember honestly if I put this one together. I want to say I have, but I might not have. Because it's not in the original package, but that doesn't mean that I didn't start it and then just not get a chance to finish it. And this is one, I can't remember if I, I can't remember when I got this one. But I'm excited about this one too. I love all the princesses. And I think the stained glass is pretty. This one might be one that actually ends up getting framed. And we're going to see because like I feel with this one that it could go either way. That it's either going to be super difficult or super easy because of all the colors in it. I'm hoping it won't be, you know, one that takes me, you know, two months to do. But we'll see. Sorry. The uh, phone told me that the me memory was full, so I had to delete some. The next one is this Disney Photo Mosaics by Robert Silvers. Yeah, Silvers. I found this one again at Goodwill, and I just thought it was cool. Mickey, you know, just kind of chilling. And I love this. I love the photo mosaics because of all the different scenes you get to see in it. So I thought this one would be fun. And that one's a thousand pieces, so. And then, all right, these last two. They were having this huge sale at work. I think puzzles were like 70% off or like buy one, get two. I mean, it was something crazy. I can't remember. But mom knows that I love to do puzzles. So she bought a couple. She also got one for herself. But the one of the ones that she got me, these are both 2,000 pieces. And I'm going to have to figure out how to do this one because... I, the, the area that I use, I use my coffee table and it's really small and I have a, like a poster board that I kind of throw over it. So I might have to get like a bigger piece of wood or something or put it on the, you know, in the floor in another room because Obi doesn't mess with my puzzles, but that's, like I said, because they're on the table. I bet if they were on the floor, it'd be all bets off unless I kept him locked out of that room. But this one is the villains and I love me some villains. We got Dr. Facilier, Hades. Mother Gothel, Hook, Yzma, Jafar, Maleficent, the Evil Queen, we got Ursula, so this one is going to be fun. And then the last one I got is possibly the one of the cooler ones, if, as far as like the Fab, is it the Fab Five or is it the Sensational yeah, it's a Sensational Six, plus a few other characters. But it's got all of the different, it's got Minnie, Mickey, it's kind of hard to see all of the different areas. It's got Goofy, Pluto, Donald, Daisy. It's got them all doing different, or on different rides and doing different things at the parks. So I thought this one was going to be fun too. Yeah, guys, that is my puzzle collection. So, I've done a few of these. I've done the Beauty and the Beast. I've done the Pocahontas. And then I'm pretty sure I've done the Star Wars. I've done this one. And they were all a blast. Now, I don't just have Disney puzzles. So, if you'd like to see the rest of my puzzles, comment down below and I can do another puzzle collection video. But... These are just the Disney ones, and yeah, it's kind of a weird obsession that I have. I love to do puzzles. So, comment down below. Do you guys like to do puzzles? If so, do you like Disney puzzles, or is there a certain one that you like? I love the Seiko uh, Thomas Kincaid. Those have been the fa my favorites out of what I've done so far, but I am also 
excited to get like a Raven's Burger. I, I want to try one of the Raven's Burger Disney ones. I just haven't been able to snag one yet. You know, can't pay the Google prices for a Raven's Burger. I mean, or if they're there, they're snatched up by the time I get there. Yeah, that's it for today, guys. See you later. Guys, I'm gonna pop back in here. I thought I'd close this thing out, but I forgot to show the one I was working on. This is also a Goodwill find. And this one was, again, one of those that was $1.99 instead of $1.19. Like, that's, I digress. That's, that's fine. But yeah. That is the last of my Disney puzzles. Yeah. So, we will see you later. Goodbye.